In this video, we will show you where you can review non-physician documentation in the EMR. As always, it starts with your desktop. You go to your inpatient list. Select the patient that you want to review and open the chart. All documentation that will be done electronically will be displayed under the notes section. For the physician, this is the easiest and quickest way for you to find documentation that's been done by each discipline. It will default under all notes and as you can see that looks like a lot of information because it's all of nursing documentation. However, if you're looking for a discipline-specific note, social services or occupational therapy, it will be displayed under that Disciplines button. When you come in in the morning, it defaults to all notes and it defaults by the most recent date. So you come in and you want to see what happened yesterday or overnight and you can see any of the documentation that was done. You can see what was documented and whether you feel that you actually need to review that or not. In some cases, it, it, it's not something that you're going to want to review. However, I will say that there's one assessment that you're going to want to look for at any time, and that is the assessment that's called Change in Condition Assessment. And what you would do is find the assessment and as in all things Meditech, if there's a blue eye there's more information there for you to see and here you can see this patient had a new onset of seizures the doctor was notified what the actions the nurses took and what the outcome was also as a result of nursing documentation I'd like to draw your attention to this history button when nurses take the past medical history from the patient, anything that they document as a positive, as in they have a history of, will default to the positives button under history. So if you want a quick look at what has this patient told nursing they have a history of, this would be a quick look for you as the physician. This is also where you would find the documentation on the uh, vaccination history of the patient.